Okay, we're back. And at this point in time, we are going towards Vasa... No, wait. Where are we going? Balboa Island. I thought we were heading to Vasa Gatton. But we've actually cleared it. And currently we are heading to Balboa Island, which is actually a little bit to the left. So we should probably angle it in that direction. Okay, we are lined, heading straight. Okay, in the meantime, what I want to do is put down some more collection nets on this side and on the other side as well. Like three more in this pattern here. And in order to do that, I need these resources. Like all of it. Like, I have so many collection nets at this point in time. Like, it just fills up my inventory, even when it's empty. And I got a shelf, alright. So, I need to keep fueling this up. Wish there was like a sort inventory type of thing here. That would make things so much easier. Like, consolidate all the resources into full stacks. Anyway... We can turn these into ropes. We need collection nets. I did have lots of nails, if I remember correctly. And I do. I have like three stacks, or two full stacks. I want to turn all of these into collection nets. It's a good place to dump our ropes. I also need to make sure that I have the planks in order to extend the foundations. Uh, yeah, we're putting the nails back in here. Oh, I hear... Ah, oh, damn it. I'm slow now. So, gonna have to sack that foundation. Now, there was one attack, so there has to be another attack coming. Usually around the engines. Unless there's only one shark. You know, I actually don't remember this, so... Uh, it doesn't look like there's another shark attacking, so... In the meantime, let's just continue working on this. Okay, that should be enough resources for now. Let's just build out foundations in this direction. And then we'll put our collection nets here. And then we'll do the other side. Okay, we have 14 planks left. Now, I don't want to cook anything because I do need to reserve those planks for extending my collection nets. So right now, it's a bit of a balancing act. Okay, so these nets are now protected. Uh-oh. This is actually bad. Like, we need to... Fuel this up. Which one's stuck? This one has fuel. This one does not. Or is it both? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, we put planks in that one. Oh no. 
Or wait. Oh no. Nope, we're actually gonna have to remove these. Wait. Oh, thanks, shark. So, apparently I was one over for the amount of foundations on here. So, we can't expand this anymore until I install a third engine. So, we're just gonna have to save up. So this will be all the foundations I will have for the time being. Probably should convert these. We'll keep two stacks of palm leaves and then I'll just convert the rest into ropes. Where are we at this point? You know what? We'll just continue on this course and then when we get close to the island, when we actually see it, then we'll start turning. Because if I start turning, what's going to happen is I stop collecting resources until the new stuff spawns out there and I manage to hit them. So we want to keep going in the same direction for as long as possible so that we continue getting these resources. In the meantime, I will continue organizing this stuff. Rock goes here. Now eventually, once I finish all of these collection nets here, what I'm going to do is install armor on them with metal ingots. That way the sharks won't attack them. And that means if I'm installing metal ingots over here, I'm not going to be expanding in that direction. Instead, I would have to expand over here and I'm out of fuel. Okay, so this one that's low on planks. So I pretty much have to reserve all my planks for fuel at this point in time. I have plenty of food, so I don't have to worry about that for the time being. Oh, shit. Damn you. I only, like, heard you a little bit. I didn't realize that was the shark attacking. Probably should pay attention to that. And you know what? I need to drink all of this, fill up my water meter, and then just fill this up. Get another bottle going. Okay, I have a full stack of planks now. now. I do need to put this back. Just to protect my collection nets. I'd rather lose foundations than lose the nets. And it actually takes up a lot of planks. Now, if I remember correctly, what we're going to get on Balboa Island is the biofuel. At least the stuff needed to make it. We're going to get bees as well. And that's a key component for that. Okay, so I have enough for the smelter now. Okay, I need scrap and nails. Let's put the smelter down, just so we don't have to deal with it later. Right here, now we have five smelters. We have some good smelting capacity. Oh, here's Balboa Island, I can see it in the distance. Oh, hi there. Now, I do need to prepare for the island. There's going to be lots of bears there. Now, we need to store the fish. You know what? Let's move all this stuff over to the chest there. Uh, actually, did we research the leather yet? No, we didn't. 
What about the feathers? That's researched. Anything else that needs to be researched? Well, I think that's it. Come to think of it, what else do we need to research? Oh, the explosive goo. Oh, there's a shark. He's all the way over there. Damn you. Alright. Anyway, let's go research the explosive goo. Can't research it. Can be dried and smelt. Oh, we, we're supposed to smelt this first. Okay, so never mind. You know, let's put this stuff away. Getting close to the island now. Let's put our feathers here. And same thing with the leather and the... You know, let's put all of our raw meat in there. Let's put leather in here. Start organizing this stuff just a little bit. You know, put our fresh meat here. You know what, let's put feathers here. We'll put our spare collection net here. Okay, we're gonna go through that entrance there. Now we're gonna prepare for this. Uh, let's put our plastic and wood here. Palm leaves and rope. And put this rock here. Okay, so we're going to bring scrap hook. And I'll probably bring the axe with me. Just so we can cut down some trees. Uh, what else? Well, we're good on food. Probably should bring some extra spears. Because we're going to encounter lots of the bears there. So planks, rope, metal ingots, bolts. Okay, need this, this. Rope and planks. I'll probably need to turn this around. Oh, we're actually really close to the island. Is this even going to work? Ah, oh, damn you. Oh, come on. Okay, back up a little bit. Turn these engines off. Okay. Now we need to turn in here just a little bit. Let's try to get into like really close to that outlet there. Not really moving, are we? All right, engines back on. Sail off. Now I'm not going to have easy access into this island. I actually have to swim in there. And there's a bridge right there. So what I want to do is try to get as close as possible. I need a way to avoid the shark, I can at least jump on that cliff, like, right there. And then way anchor, or opposite of way anchor, drop anchor. Let's turn these off. Alright, so, water up. Now, we do need to repair these foundations. Okay, we're good. Uh, 
did he take a piece off here? No. Alright, so we're good. Let's make a couple... Oh! Hey! Don't do that. Don't do that! Don't be doing that. About to disembark here. Okay, so... We got a couple spears. We're probably going to need it. Oh, sweep nets. Yeah, we're bringing this with us. And maybe I'll take the shovel as well. Okay, it looks like I am equipped to do everything here. And one more thing, I should probably bring headlight since it's getting dark already. Let's get a battery, rope, and scrap. What do I need for a battery? Copper ingot, plastic, and scrap. we we'll make three batteries. You know, we're going to store the batteries in here. And then we'll just have one. Now we still need to smelt all of this, but we are using our planks in order to continue expanding our raft. Now then, where's the tool here? Headlight, rope, and... S just put the scrap back. Rope. And there we go. Okay, so... Okay, so the auction bottle and the headlight is mutually exclusive. Okay, let's turn on the headlight. Oh, probably should. You know what I'm going to do is drink all of this water. Since Balboa Island is a really big place. Let's max out water. And then we still have eight pieces of fish here. Pieces of shark meat. Alright, let's do this. Where's shark? Where are you, sharky? Ah, oh, fuck. Where are you? Where in the hell are you? I sure as hell didn't kill you. Definitely did not kill you. Hmm. Well, that's confusing. Alright, so here's the entrance. Alright, here we go. Balboa Island. Watch out for bears. Now these wild berries are used for the, uh... What's his face? The, uh, big bear boss. I don't know what it's called, but the bear boss... Can't cut down a tree. I feel like we should be able to cut down trees here. Well, anyway. I guess we can worry about that later. Right now. There's two things I want to get on this island. First, we need the beehives. Ranger station, relay station. So... The main objective is the relay stations and the ranger station. But what I want to do here is collect some bees and get some honeycombs. Oh, there's a bear. Come here, bear. Ah, damn it. Ah, you actually got me. I am sucking at this whole kiting thing. Oh. 
There we go. I took a lot of unnecessary damage. I can't even pick this guy up. Took a lot of unnecessary damage, but... Should be clear now. Let's get some honeycombs. Now, I do need to catch these bees. Come here, you. Hey. 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 Come here. There we go. So, by catching these bees, I get jars of bees. Somehow, I magically get the glass for the jars. Just don't question the game. Just don't. Alright, here we go. Honeycombs. Alright, we've got 12 honeycombs and 9 bee jars. I think that's it for this area. Hang on. Yeah, that's it, it looks like. Oh, check up here. No, definitely it. Definitely it. Alright, so let's head for the objective. I think we're going to do the ranger station first. Now, if I remember correctly, you're supposed to jump across like a pool of acid or something. Can I cut down this tree? This looks... Yeah, this looks cuttable. Seven planks of wood. Okay, so it's the smaller trees that we can cut down. So it can't be too big and it can't be too small. There's another bear. Come here, bear. Come here. So far, so good. There we go. No damage. That's how it's done. And that's how it will continue to be done for the rest of this island. Hopefully. Henry's stuff, keep out. Nice stuff. Anyway, let's continue on to the ranger station. I think it's time to eat. Gotta stay on top of that. Like, the last thing I want to do is take on a bear, and then food and water is, like, almost out. Like, that would really slow me down, cause me to take unnecessary damage. Here's the pool of acid. Well... I guess it's nuclear waste. All right, let's do this. Easy peasy. Yeah, all of those crates just fall into the radioactive waste. And then pop back up. Alright, so we'll do the ranger station first. If you've lived here, your house is gone. Okay, so we need one light bulb. Let's clear this out. Oh, here we go. Biofuel refiner. That's what we need to create the biofuel for the, the engines. Bruno's wrench, Bruno's hammer, Bruno's saw. Okay, so we do need to get these three key items. And I forget what happens after you do that. Okay, a note. Okay, I should probably start reading these since 
the islands are going to be getting more complex. Except... Doesn't give me anything useful. Okay, let's get this crate. Okay, probably should eat this. And then, we've got fish stew. Sturdier and tastier fish stew. Let's eat this now. And what that does is basically extends my hunger meter over, like, the max that I can get. So, this is what the meals are for, basically. I need... That reminds me, I need to make a cooking pot, but basically that's what those meals do, is, like, increases your hunger far past the max. Now, I don't think it does anything to thirst, but I guess it really doesn't need to. Anyway, here's the first relay station. We're gonna check the outside and then go inside. I guess we can jump up here. Or not. Oh, it's on the other side. There we go. Ah, uh, here we go. Catfish did... Now, do I need to keep this biofuel refiner? Hmm. Probably should pick that up. I don't think I have that recipe yet. So, we're gonna get rid of this scrap hook. Since it's low durability now. Alright, let's go inside. I probably should take this off, except I can't. Or, yeah, I can. You save the battery on that. Pick up this note. Left you the auxiliary boat. I'm sorry, Bruno. Managed to contact someone today. Must have been Navy, but they sounded foreign. Asked about you, but they didn't seem like they were receiving since number six went underwater. Left them a message just in case. I found your wrench out by the clearing. Hmm. Okay, so his wrench is on a clearing somewhere. Wait, is that it? Or... Oh, there we go. One out of three relay stations active. Okay, so we need to activate all three relay stations. And there's two and three. So we need to go over there. First, I probably should go back to the boat and unload this stuff. Probably should put another spear in our inventory, in our hot bar. Do I really have to go across this or can I like go over here? 